The state is still two and a half weeks away from hunting season, but some Arizonans have been jumping the gun. Cronkite News reporter Juliet Thatcher has a sneak preview on the state's plan to combat it. The Mule Deer Foundation here in Phoenix has just donated a mechanical deer to the Game and Fish Department in hopes to stop hunters who may try to start their hunt early. And oh dear, is this causing some upset in the hunting community? Poachers are, in my opinion, the cancer of, of uh, the hunting community. In Arizona, Game and Fish reported sighting more than 600 people in 2014 who were illegally attempting to shoot wildlife. In order to combat this, the Mule Deer Foundation donated a mechanical mule deer to use as a decoy to catch poachers. Although Game and Fish has used similar decoys in the past, the new technology makes the deer appear more lifelike. While the Game and Fish Department regulates the wildlife population, the animals actually belong to the residents of Arizona. People should know that they own that wildlife and that's being taken from them, just as if someone came in their backyard and snatched their dog. A flick of the tail and the turn of a head could be all that's needed to entice poachers. Once someone has taken a shot, officers stationed nearby will try to catch the offenders. If caught, poachers could see up to six months jail time and a $750 fine. Those close to the cause, however, think these penalties might not be enough. I mean, it's the, the bottom line is thieves are thieves and that's what these folks are. So they need to spend time in jail. I think there should be confiscation of, of weapons, confiscation of their uh, vehicles. I think they should go after where they live too. I have no feelings of uh, guilt to say that I would like to see them lose everything they have if they try to steal things from people. I asked the Game and Fish Department when they plan to deploy their new decoy, but they said they don't plan to tell anyone in hopes of catching poachers off guard. They said they also intend to change the rack of the mule deer to keep poachers on their toes. In the Broadcast Center, Julia Thatcher, Cronkite News.